police are following me. I'm not surprised. This is the big church here. I think this is Elizabeth. And then this is St. Michael. <clears throat> Okay, praise the Lord, everyone. I've come to Slovakia to preach the gospel and ask everyone, if they died today, would you go to heaven or hell? The Bible says it is, uh, there is a way that seems right unto man, but in the end it leads to death. If you want to go to heaven you must be born again to see the kingdom of God. God's kingdom is righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Spirit. Do you walk in peace? Jesus said, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the sons of God. Are you a son of God tonight, or are you a son of the devil? There's two kinds of people according to Jesus. You're either saved, or you are damned. Narrow is the way, broad is the road that leads to destruction. Jesus wants you to be saved. There's nothing you've done that Jesus cannot forgive. And that is good news. You can be forgiven of all your sins. You can be blessed. <coughs> God can set you free of smoking. I used to smoke. Jesus set me free of smoking many years ago. I quit smoking at 25 years old, praise God. I just had enough, and I knew that God could set me free. God had already delivered me. Yahweh, Jesus Christ, delivered me from alcohol, drug addiction. So I knew that Jesus could deliver me from anything else. I needed freedom from hallelujah. I wasn't sure if I wanted to say hallelujah or hello, so it came out a little weird. Okay? Came out a little weird. Like hello, hallelujah. Apparently, there's a lot of people that get married in Slovakia because there's wedding dress photos all over this country. So that's good that this country believes in committing to one another. Hopefully nobody's fornicating in this country. Anybody out here living in premarital sex? Okay, so everybody's married in covenant with one another. That's good. Because the Bible declares that fornicators will not inherit the kingdom of God. Drunkards will not inherit the kingdom of God. There are things you do that can keep you out of heaven, and that's bad news. The good news is Jesus can save you, no matter what your favorite sin is. Jesus can deliver you. I've been delivered. Where are you from? I am from the USA. Hallelujah. United States of Sodom and Gomorrah. My country is wicked. But heaven is not wicked. Heaven is clean. Heaven is pure. Many of you, you don't want to go to heaven because you don't want to be around God. Well, that has to do with holiness. So you would go to hell for whiskey? 
Jack Daniels whiskey from Tennessee. No, I think it was too early for rough any pain or sex in that, but Because I come from Tennessee, where Jack Daniels from hell comes from. And I drank Jack Daniels at 17 and barfed up black stuff. Ugh. This is a divine appointment, sir. You were supposed to meet me and hear the message that God cares for you and God wants to save you. God wants to save you. I have no doubt about it. British whiskey's better. I never had it that I'm aware of, sir. All I know is... No, I had enough sin, sin, sin. And I got tired of sinning. And I want to be a saint now. Hallelujah. What? You want me to get louder? I can get louder. Sure, I can get louder. No problem. Matter of fact, I have a trumpet in my purse. Yes, I have a trumpet. Yes, I play I play the shofar. One moment. You know, Rosh Hashanah was just a few days ago. It just ended. There's a goat up there. Jesus talked about goats, wolves, and sheep. How many of you here are goats bucking God tonight? Hallelujah is right. I'm fixing to blow the shofar over Slovakia and run Mary out of this town. You people need to destroy your Mary idols. No wonder you people are drunk. You're drunk because you pray to Mary. What would you do if you saw steps and you were a street preacher <laughs> and two cops there? And they don't seem to care. Well, that's cool. Look at this view, people. Look at this view. Slovakia!